Hey guys, thanks for joining me. Um, today I'm gonna be painting Jason Voorhees. Let's get this going. Gotta get my workstation right. So Jason is red and that red is vibrant. So today I mixed magenta and copper to get me this red. All right. I know I switch it up sometimes and that's on purpose I just like to test out different colors I like to test out um, different combinations because if I stick with just one red I'm not really doing myself or you guys any justice I'm here to make the mistakes you know what I mean so you don't have to make the mistakes this is a 50-50 copper and magenta mix right there and it kind of gives me that good murderous savage hockey mask red look at that you can see the grooves and I also have some good news actually we're gonna start making our own molds um, also will be available on our website the cauldron dot store and we're gonna start selling cool modes we want to make a Cardi B bath bomb <laughs> couldn't find one anywhere my wife's a fan so tried to find one couldn't find one then I decided we should make our own so that's what we're going to do. Alright, Jason is super easy, guys. This is an easy, very, very easy and appealing bath bomb you can paint. And by appealing, I mean customer appeal. So we're just using activated charcoal and we're just going to dab in those dots. Because keep in mind, the mask itself, I'll do an eyeball to show you. The mask itself has sides so when you paint it's okay to leave a little bit of that edge up there near the top near the surface of the mask because every mask has edges has sides has a thickness has width I don't know I guess plenty of different words there you can use to get what I'm trying to tell you One of my neighbors decided to wake up super early and cut the grass. There we go. So I decided now I'll get up and paint some bath bombs. Fuck it. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Bow. I'm guessing that's how it is. No, no, no. There's the divots. I knew I hit those for a reason. And with this little, look, all I'm doing is dabbing. All I'm doing is dabbing this activator chart. Look how fast. I'm almost done. That's it. I'm just dabbing. Dab City. Dabberino. There we go. There we go. Uh oh. Hit the camera. The camera is right next to my hand. And when I paint, I'm one of those guys that gets like up close on the paper. So, I had a reference to the one that I already painted to see where these dots go. Super cool. I think I might make one of these just to throw some razzle dazzle on the Jason Voorhees bath bomb. I think I might make that one like. You know, the one with the eye. I don't know what fucking Jason that is. But I think I'll do that on this one. Just to get you some razzle dazzle. Some rasal dazzle. As they call it in the Spanish. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh, man. Let's see what we get. Let's do the outline in black of the eye. Oh man, this is going to be funky.
Man, this is a very tight space to draw in. It's angled. I do not recommend doing this if you're an amateur with that paintbrush. Cause boy, I'm trying to do this right now and it is putting my wrist in a weird position. See, you can't get it everywhere because then your brush ends up touching the side of the just like that. And since this is white, I don't want to put any white on top of it because I don't have a white that's going to be as white as this white. I got pearl white and crystal white and I'll have to paint the whole mask. Oh, so boom! That's how you do it, right? That's the eyeball or whatever. Um, now we're gonna get. Let's make his eye blue. F it. We'll get some blue on there. That's just a little bit of French blue. NBD. Can really use anything. I don't. I'm not sure. You know, what color eyes Jason freaking Voorhees has but I'm gonna make them sparkle that's what I'm doing there. oh yeah and you see I, I freestyle some of these paintings man just because I'm trying to get, you know, we're trying to give our customer a nice experience with our bat bomb. All the way around, from the very first time you see it. From the very first time you see our bath bomb, we want you to feel like, oh man, this is the shit. I've had some people tell us oh I haven't even used it like really why the hell would you buy a bath bomb and not use it that looks pretty wicked I don't know. how do you guys feel about that I guess I could have loosened up that black a little bit I don't know it is what it is but you know just play around with it alright guys that's the Jason Voorhees bath bomb uh, remember 50-50 magenta and copper on the red and that black is just activated charcoal. Appreciate it. Thank you. Peace.